In a recent study, scientists discovered that the first sign of injury in glaucoma actually occurs in the brain. Glaucoma is generally considered a disease of the eye in which sensitivity to ocular pressure causes damage to the retina and optic nerve, which are components of the central nervous system and do not regenerate. The damage begins in the peripheral visual field and progresses toward the center, resulting in complete blindness unless detected early. For this reason, degeneration in glaucoma is often hard to detect. Combining this new understanding of where the first neuronal injury for glaucoma occurs with the fact that the incidence of injury increases with age, researchers now have insight into how the loss of sensory function occurs in normal aging. Traditionally, glaucoma therapies have focused on lowering ocular pressure within the eye. But the recent study gives credence to taking a new direction of study, focusing on neuronal activity in the middle of the brain, where the optic nerve forms its first connections.